Okay, the first thing, if you are an Apple user like I am, if you're on an iPhone or an iPad, don't try to use the Safari browser. If you do, the Safari browser will automatically force you to the YouTube app and you cannot uh, complete this task through the YouTube app. So, use the Google Chrome browser and once you've got the Google Chrome opened up, uh, go to your YouTube page. In the lower right hand corner of your channel page, you'll see three horizontal dots. Click on those dots and then scroll down on that menu till you see Request Desktop Site. Click on it. That'll change you from the mobile site to the desktop site and you can perform all the functions that you would normally be able to perform on the desktop on your mobile device. Uh, this menu, find YouTube Studio, click on it. That'll open up another page where you'll see in the lower left hand corner the gear settings icon. Uh, click on that icon and that will open up another page and you'll see permissions on the left hand side and click on permissions here and that will take you to the next page and from this point on all the functions are exactly the same whether you're looking at it on a mobile phone or on a desktop so we're going to go to the desktop view and here click on permissions and this will open up a window where you can see your current email address associated with your YouTube channel and then in the upper right hand corner of that window you'll see a blue link that says invite. You can click on that link and then type in the email address that you want to associate with this channel. Once you have the email address typed in, the next box below that has a little drop down triangle so click on that and you're going to select the access that you want to allow the new email address to have. And since you're eventually going to change completely to this email address, choose Manager. Then click the Done button. And you'll see the new email address pops up here with the access that you've allowed. And then there's a pending invitation notation here, which actually means that they have sent a which actually means they've sent an email to this email address and once they respond to that email then you can continue. So we'll click Save at this time. Click on the email then click on Accept the Invitation. And it says now that we're all set as Channel Manager on the YouTube channel Joe Blow. So we can go to that channel. It says here you're now a manager, which is what we wanted to do. Back to permissions, and you can see owner manager. As we stated earlier, nothing changes as far as the videos that you had on the account or the channel, uh, views, and subscribers. All that remains the same. All you did was associate a new email account with your YouTube channel. If this video was helpful, like it, share it, and subscribe.